Hello everybody. So today I want to talk about calculus. The topic that is about differential equations. So now I want to show you how to answer. I will put about b equals to this one and q equals to this one. So we have the s that means we need to do first the derivative of b with respect to y. So we just have only y in here. First the derivative of y we have number one so we have only number two. This one and this one we don't have y so you got number zero. We have dy that means we need to do first the derivative of q with respect to s. So we just have only s in here and that is about number one. So this one you got number zero. We see that number two and number two they are same. So this is about exact. Now we need to set up about the function fsy equals to the integration. So I select about this one plus 3sy. So the integration of s we have s square over 2. The next one we have 2sy. The next one we have negative 5s. Next we need to do first the derivative of f with respect to y. So this one we don't have y so you got number 0. This one we have number 1. This one we don't have y so you got number 0. And we know that this one equals to this one. Now we simplify 2s for the both side and we have like this. Next, we put the integration for the both sides. The integration of 3y we have 3y square over number 2. Next one we have negative 5 y and I will put about c. Now we return back to this one. The integration of this one we have 3sy. 3sy equals to this one. And I will put this one cone here. And we know that this one equal to fsy, fsy equal to c. And now we can simplify like this. Next, we multiply both sides by number 2. So this one we have 3s square. This one we have number 4. This one we have number 10. This one we have 3 y square. This one we have number 10. This one we have 2 c. Because c that is about the constants. When we have number 2 multiplied by c, they still consider about the constant. And this is the final answer. That is the end. Thank you for watching.